I'm Alexis, crafter behind Persialoo.com, and today I'm talking all about my brand new favorite crafting toy, the Silhouette Alta 3D printer. This guy right here. I had so much fun playing around with this since I got it a few weeks ago. I've been learning all the tricks, creating tons of projects. You can see some of them here. So if you've been curious about the Alta or you just got one, this video is for you. I'm gonna walk you through all the steps for unboxing and setting up your machine and creating your first project. You guys ready to do this? Let's go. Start off by carefully removing all the packing materials from your machine. Next, plug in the power cord, connect the USB cord to your computer, and finally, flip on the power switch. Next, you wanna to go to silhouetteamerica.com setup. Here, you can select the Alta, you can register your machine, you can download the software, and you can also get access to the free shapes that come with your machine. Once you've installed the software, and you've logged into your account, you can access the free designs in your library. Next, we're going to prepare the printing platform by applying a piece of platform tape. Peel off one half of the platform tape. It splits down the middle to make it easy. Then line up the notch with the edge of your platform and carefully smooth down the tape. You don't want any wrinkles or bubbles. You can use the scraping tool included to get a nice smooth application. I've found that putting a little bit of glue stick on top of the tape really helps the filament to adhere to the platform so that you avoid problems like this where the first layer doesn't stick. When your platform's all ready, put it into the machine by lining up the notch and clicking it into place. Next, place your filament on top of the machine. Any 1.75 millimeter PLA filament will work. Then thread the filament through the hole, feed it through the tube, and finally squeeze the lever and insert the filament into the hole. You may have to jiggle it around a little bit, but you should see the filament enter the tube inside of the machine. Then click load in the software, and after the print head heats up, you'll see the filament start to melt out of the print nozzle. Then you are ready to print. Next, you need to choose your design in the software. I'm going to print an alphabet bead design that I got from the Silhouette Design Store. Next, click 3D Print, and then select your print quality settings. There are three default settings, and you can see as I change the settings, the print time changes as well. Then click Print. Your machine will warm up and then start to print the design. When the machine is done printing, allow it to cool for a couple of minutes and then you can remove it with your scraper tool from the platform. I printed three sample beads to give you an idea of the difference in quality amongst the three default settings. If you like, you can finish off your printed piece by sanding it or painting it. There's just so many fun things that you can do with these 3D printed objects. I've been having a lot of fun playing around with my Silhouette Alta. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions about the Alta, please let me know. I'm working on some more tutorials and guides and projects, and I would love to hear what you're interested in learning. Until next time, happy making!